Um, well, I'm a prime example of how TechnoServe uh, is investing in opportunities for staff to learn and develop um, by the sheer fact that I just uh, ended a week-long leadership meeting. Um, that was our first ever at the organization. Um, yeah, and it was meant to bring together uh, nominated leaders of the organization to teach and coach around leadership skills and exhibit the values of the organization. Uh, and that's just an example of many of such types of programs. Um, we do management trainings and because I'm in HR, I work closely on capacity building and development of our staff um, throughout the world. Um, I've seen TechnoServe create an inclusive and equi equitable working environment um, in different ways. Uh, one is by an actual hire of a talent director in the HR team to focus on diversity, equity, and inclusion, um, which is already a few years ago uh, that that happened. Um, we also, she actually, <laughs> also created um, an internship program uh, to bring in more diversity into the organization and exposure to the work that we do. Um, so that's one way. I think another way um, through a lot of our HR policies that have been updated uh, to precisely focus on ensuring that we treat people the same way equitably, regardless of where they're from, what level of position they have. Um, and my team specifically worked on a global compensation overhaul, uh, which exhibits precisely that, uh, creating benchmarks and standards of how we compensate our staff um, that are the same regardless of where they're based. <laughs> you get a lot of really high quality people that work here um, with very diverse backgrounds and I, for me personally that's very enriching um, and in the spirit of you know always learning uh, that is something that um, can't be beat.